What's up, guys? So I'm going to cover um, Reddit posts over here talking about censorship in the Brawl Stars community, or at least in the Reddit, which is, I mean, where we get our main sources of information and all that, you know? So apparently talking badly about people who defend the game warranties or removal. So yeah, this was made six hours ago, and he put, this guy put some posts here. So let's take a look at them. So right here, remove free stuff. So yeah, we used to have 15 win challenges. I think we still have those. I, I saw one, you know, a while ago, but I don't know if that still comes up. I will say I've not been keeping track of that. The hyper charges, they got removed. <laughs> they removed the fucking hyper charges. So no more free hyper charges for whatever reason, just greed. And then, yeah, number two, add compensation. That's actually a nerf. So yeah, exactly. These eggs, the star drops, all that, that huge fiasco in the summer. Or was it the summer? What was that Godzilla event? That was a terrible event. You know, you barely got anything. You got scraps. You got all this. Yeah, right here. A little shit. Bling. Who cares about bling? And then now you have this war between the star drops and the mega boxes, which is so stupid. Uh, obviously, the star drops are better, even though they are not better because they suck ass. Star drops are a horrible addition to the game. But as of right now, they're better than my mega boxes for progression. And then backlash, so people get mad. And number four, congratulations, you got bootlickers. And yeah, all of you guys defend this shit. I don't know why the whole community defends Brawl Stars and whatever they do. It's like, oh, cosmetics. And then I'll, I can't really see what's going on, like all this stuff. But, you know, coin shortage. Let me see. Bad randoms. Yeah. So people defend it no matter what. I don't understand why you guys can get paid for Brawl Stars. Are they paying you? Are they, you know, sponsoring you? Like, what the fuck? I understand, like, the YouTubers, because no YouTuber wants to lose their, their very precious, precious titles. Their title of being a Brawl Stars content creator or the creator code or anything like that. They want to keep that gravy train growing. So. They're not going to betray the, the hand that feeds them, you know? So over here, <laughs> they're giving away free stuff. Why are people complaining? God, this community is so ungrateful. I hate when people do that. Like, you guys, <clears throat> you guys are actually insane. <laughs> are defending the Brawl Stars developers here, giving free stuff. Yeah, free. So Brawl Stars turns it up. They make progression twice as slow, but they give one goal every day. <laughs> and I don't know the video. I guess this is like a whole meme with the video, but, you know, I can't see it. But yeah, I mean, the 15 goal in the shop, I just got that earlier. That's terrible. That's absolutely horrible. Inflation actually happened in the world, in the real world, and now in the Brawl Stars world. So that <laughs> is just laughable. So over here, the one go, the the one go to option when the devs make yet another shitty decision, Brawl Stars defenders be like, at least this is not as bad as Clash Royale. So terrible, terrible saying. Uh, yeah, I mean, come on, really? Is that the standard now? We're ha we're holding the standard of Brawl Stars to Clash Royale. Like, come on, guys, don't be fucking stupid. And yeah, so I have not seen this one commented and, and gotta admit the devs are really good at convincing people about it, literally. But I've been trying to tell. Game is unbalanced, progression sucks, scammy, all of this is masked by giving them free stuff. Yeah, the free stuff, it's not enough. It's not enough. It's not enough to cover up all the damage. I mean, there's so much damage to the, the economy and everything, the game. The hyperchargers are pay to win. Every the level eleven even got a huge gap between level ten and eleven, you know. It, it's really pay to win now. And yeah, it, it's terrible. So <clears throat> I think that's the last one on this. This is another duplicate, but the moral story guys, and they're censoring this. I'm surprised this post itself is not censored because I mean, it's bashing them, but I mean, it's not even really bashing. It's just like calling it out. So let's read some of these comments here, but the, whatever number that is, I'm not, I don't even know how to read numbers post of the day talking about mega boxes versus star drops really approve no issue. Yeah. Those are like spamming the whole entire freaking Reddit, man. I mean, I'm not even on here. I just coming from the news, but shit, I just see that every day. And another thing guys, really, we need to get the star drops out. Like this is a whole stupid war we're having. The star drops are better. Vote for the fucking star drops. Stop voting for mega boxes. Like, are you kidding me? Like, it's just so dumb. You're just getting cosmetics and nothing good. The mega boxes are a huge disappointment. So, uh, Brawl Stars has really uh, fallen off a long time ago. Hope this post stays up. Well, it has surprisingly, at least for six hours. Uh, so, he's talking about the Clash Royale. I mean, I heard it's bad, but honestly, I haven't played it, so I can't give a solid opinion. I returned to the game two months ago. I was surprised to find boxes and uh, PowerPoints and gold conversion removed. I mean, I'm not surprised. It kind of felt like a loophole. Uh, I, I mean, I don't mind them patching that, but still, I mean, we have this huge imbalance between PowerPoints and gold. So, uh, I mean, I wish there was another way to kind of balance it out. But knowing these developers, it's always going to be like that. But I always thought that was a loophole. Uh, instant removal. Wait, what did he say? I made a post talking about how we actually had enough gold to progress and open almost all brawlers. Uh, instant removal. Uh, post the second time instant removal. Yeah. So, guys. So it's Reddit. I mean, they're Reddit mods. That's what they do, right? They just ban stuff they don't like and 
ban people they don't like. I mean, that's typical Discord mods, Reddit mods. Like, that's what they do, guys. So, that's very sad. And, I mean, it's the main Brawl Stars, like, uh, community, you know? This is where all you guys can come together and post your stuff. But, apparently not. So, guys, this channel right here, if you guys want to post anything good or bad, nobody's going to ban you. Feel free. But other than that, I mean, there's no other really, there's not really a platform you can go onto to post what you think about this game or anything like that. So the last straw was when they nerfed the end of the Brawl Pass rewards because Star Jobs compensated the nerf. Yeah, no, that was terrible, dude. They made it okay with the Brawl Stars track, like the, what is it, the Star Track? No, uh, the uh, what the fuck is it called? The Brawl Pass track, right? The free one? You can get all the rewards like that and gold, a bunch of rewards, but now... The star drops at the end are not even worth grinding for. It's just all a huge gamble. It's not even worth it. It's a terrible, terrible changes. Nerfing the shit out of everyone. Uh, in a game for kids, it's easy to convince kids that their decisions are the best for the game. So we're trying to convince all community full of pre and boys and that Melody's hot. Yeah. <laughs> I guess you got a point. Um, I guess everyone simps for these anime characters. I mean, yeah. <clears throat> I have not the strongest argument there, but. I mean, maybe I'm too old to understand something like that. Uh, did you guys get... Oh, here we go. Did you guys forget about the biggest progression nerf from Club Shop? You could max Brawlers in seconds by buying a Power Points and Club Coins and Coins, and it was a Club Masters. I maxed a lot of Brawlers with Club Coins. Yeah. They replaced that with a stupid Mega Pig, which nobody... I don't even think I... Dude, I don't even remember that. When was the last time that came out? And don't you think... Oh, here we go. Doesn't that say that the progression is too easy? I don't think you should be able to max a Brawler in seconds. Yeah, here we go. Another Defender, guys. Shout out to this guy, defending Brawl Stars. No matter what, they're always going to be like, wait, we can't have that much progression. We need to stop that. We need to regress and have everyone stay stuck with like level 7 Brawlers. That's great. I, I just don't get it why people keep defending. It's game is so bad right now. And, you know, with the censorship, with the people defending it, it's not going to get better. So, guys, feel free to leave your thoughts down below what you think of the state of the game right now nobody else is going to cover this nobody else is going to bash a game they all want to protect the creator codes they all want to stay in good terms of brawl stars and aspiring creators are never going to criticize the game so guys use this platform to voice your thoughts good or bad even if you love the game hey go ahead nobody's going to ban you here and with all that said everyone let me know what you think and let me know other topics you want me to cover but i'm going to wrap it up Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next Brawl Stars video.